I'm Mindy from Cute Girls Hairstyles. Ryan's joining me today. Hey guys. We cannot keep our hands off of this red <laughs> hair that is so beautiful. We are calling this the crisscross bun and OMG might be a new favorite. It was not only easy, but it looks amazing. Yeah. It really does. So if you guys have not already subscribed to our channel, be sure to click the button right here and let's get on to the video. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna start by prepping her hair. So I'm gonna turn Ryan this way and I am going to, her hair is looking really good. It's not oily or anything, so it doesn't need dry shampoo. I'm gonna take some Heritage by Mindy texture spray and just spritz it a little bit through the hair like this. This is just gonna add a little grit and texture that's gonna make our jobs a little bit easier when we get there. Then I'm gonna take some Magic Dust Root Powder and tap it on the top. This is just gonna help her roots have a little more volume when we get that ponytail secured the way we want it to. Now I'm gonna take her hair and I'm gonna kind of side sweep two pieces, kind of by her ears, just like this. So kind of like half back. And if you want to right here, you can even add a little wiggle room hairspray. This is why I like this wiggle room because it's just light enough that you can still work with the hair after it goes on and it won't, like it doesn't get like crunchy like, like heavy duty hairspray does sometimes. So you can still work with it, but it's gonna help smooth. When I get the there, I'm gonna take an elastic and secure these two pieces together. this you can see I did it I didn't do it like super tight up here I did it a little bit lower now I'm gonna take the hair and flip it through okay and we are pretty much set for our next step now I'm gonna take the hair divide it in half it doesn't have to be exact middle but pretty close I'm gonna take another elastic and I'm, my goal is to get it sitting like pretty high close to this elastic. Okay, you don't want it like down here. You want it up a little bit higher, closer to the scalp and closer to that original elastic. Now I'm gonna repeat on this side. Another elastic. And I'm trying to pretty much make sure that I have them um, pretty much this centered between these two. Okay, now at this point, we're gonna start doing our wrap. So I'm just gonna make sure I can get my fingers in like that. And I'm gonna take this wiggle room hairspray again. I'm gonna take the wiggle room hairspray and just spritz it. Again, that's just gonna help. She's got layers and everybody has flyaways in their hair. So it's just gonna kind of help smooth it all. So I'm gonna reach up in here, take my fingers like this behind this twist and grab this piece. And just pull it through. So it's going, just to be clear, so everybody gets it, it's going behind the twist, but in front of this bottom ponytail. Okay, now I'm gonna take and repeat on this side. So fingers up, I'm gonna take this left side hair, make sure I get it all, and just tug it through this. This is where we get the crisscrossing starting to happen, okay? And this one's sitting on top currently, so I wanna work with this one at this point. I'm gonna take my fingers back through, take this piece, overlap it, and now repeat on the side. Hey Ryan, will you help hold this for me? Yeah. There you go, you can always use a clip or the person's hair. Reach up, cross it, cross it over. And don't worry too much about like these little flyaways because we can pin them when we're done. Okay, now on this side, we ended on this side again. So I'm gonna come back over here I'm gonna do one more for the length of her hair. Chris. And one more little crossy. Like this. And you can see we've woven this really beautiful bun. Now under here, I'm gonna just take these pieces that are the ends or the flyaways, and I'm gonna secure them with an elastic right here at the bottom. Okay. Then we're just gonna use a little bobby pin to get rid of those guys. Right, pick it up, tuck them so they hide. And then you can kind of gently loosen so you can really overemphasize that crisscross. 
This is a great moment to take a little texture powder or texture spray again. And if you want to, so it just holds a little grit or the finishing hairspray, whichever your preferred method is. And kind of smooth, polish, pull, and really overemphasize those crisscrosses. And also right here, I always like to loosen this top up. This is where that root magic dust that we put in before comes in because it's gonna nicely elevate that for us. There you have a really nice updo. Okay, let's do the final spin. It looks so good. I'm so excited for you guys to see this one. Ryan's like, can I wear it home? Yeah. And I'm like, yes. Truly one of the easiest, best looking prom do's I've ever done. I love this one. What do you think? I love it. I took a picture and showed it to her. She's yeah. like, huh. Okay, if you guys have not already subscribed to our channel, be sure to click the button right here. You can check out other prom videos by clicking over there. And we'll see you guys next week with another awesome hairstyle. Bye guys. <laughs>